hello everyone welcome back so in this video i will cover how to transfer token from your account to pd account and then from pd account to somebody else account okay so like i have discussed already in one of my video like how to transfer spl token from your account to pd account so what i have done like in this video i will cover the entire life cycle that is to transfer spl token from your account to pd account and then, then from pda to somebody else account so here mainly there are two classes if i see this project so mainly there are two classes one is for test cases that is ts file and the second is your rust file lib.rs so first i will cover the uh, this ts file so in the t in this ts file uh, this part actually contains your import statement like whatever the libraries which are needed and then uh, there are some uh, constant like the program id your program and there are two two virtual user okay so one is for user wallet the other one is for winner wallet and then i have written one test cases so i have given it like is initialized but i i am doing everything within this a uh, single test cases so first here i am getting uh, like a transaction and then i am dropping some of the uh, solana the fake solana currency to this user wallet in the second part i am uh, dropping some solana currency uh, to this winner wallet and then i am creating a mint account uh, from the user wallet account and then i have an associated token account for this user wallet associated with this particular mint address okay and then to this token account right this token account i am minting five token okay so until here we have five token uh, being minted to this particular token account so now because we have to first transfer uh, this token and i'm keeping amount equal to one because i am going to transfer only one token one spl token from my account to pd account and then from pd to the uh, the other account so i will use amount as a variable so to transfer token from your account to pd account you require two two pd two different pda one is the state pda the other one is the token pda so token pda is to store the token and state pda is to have the authority over the token pda account okay so here i am uh, having this pda use the pda state and then i'm just checking like if it is null if it is null then i'm calling this function in initialize state pda and it will initialize the state pda and then i'm confirming this transaction so until here what it will do it will actually initialize your state pda then we have another transaction transaction one in this transaction i am actually uh, generating this token pda okay and then i'm checking whether this token pda exists or not if it does not exist then it will call this method initialize token pda and it will initialize your token account and then i'm sending and confirm okay so until here we have initialized the token pd account and the state pd account now comes the transfer part now we have to transfer the token from my account to the pd account so for that we have this send token pdm method that i have written inside this lib.rs so whatever the method that, that we are calling that is basically uh, being written in this lib.rs okay so this function will actually transfer the amount amount is nothing but the one one token from your account to the token pd account okay and then i'm sending this transaction now comes the last transaction that is transaction three so in this transaction we are going to transfer the token from pd account to the some other wallet account so if you see here uh, this is the shit account uh, for the for the token that we have transferred and this is the token pd account it is same basically okay nothing new just like i have written it twice and i'm just checking if it is null or not null then i am actually generating a soc token account with the with the third wallet that is winner wallet okay so let's say we have user wallet so we are transferring account oh sorry spl token from user account to pda and then from pda to winner wallet okay so i'm here i am actually generating the associated token account with the winner wallet because we have to transfer we cannot directly transfer spl token to winner wallet okay we can transfer token from pda to the associated token account uh, with the winner wallet okay so this is the associated token account with the winner wallet and then here i am calling this function set token winner 
so what it will do it will actually send the token from your pd account to the winner associated token account okay so this is about your ts file so if i come here so here like this is these are some statements and this is for initialize shit pd so if you go to here right on the context part so here you can see right here actually we are initializing this is shit pd okay so this particular statement will help to initialize or create the state PDA. Okay, so in initialize state PDA, we are doing nothing. Our function is empty. If I go up, you, you can see, right? There is nothing written inside it. It is just like we are just initializing the state PDA using the uh, uh, anchor uh, framework. Then comes the initialize token PDA. Okay, here also we are doing nothing. It, it is just we are initializing the token PDA. If, you, if we will go here in this particular struct or, or this macro, so here also we are telling like we have to initialize this token PDA and we are passing our seeds. Okay, so it will initialize your token PDA. Then we have the send token PDA. Okay, so in send token PDA, uh, what we are doing, we are actually first generating our seed. Okay, so seed is like the bump and then this bump value we are taking into some array. And then we have this deposit token account okay and using deposit token account state and bomb vector we are actually generating our seed in us okay and that we are coming to to slice the array of array and then it is we have this outer it will help us to sign the transaction so if you see here we are just transferring a token from from your account this, that is token account to the token pd account okay and authority is the sender because when sender is transferring the token it means sender has authority later on the authority will be with the state pd but because we are transferring the token account now, so the authority will be the, with the sender. And here we are just passing our signer seed, outer as outer dot as slice. So it will sign our transaction. Okay. So this is about, and then we have this method transfer. Okay. So here we are passing our instruction and the amount, like how many uh, token you want to transfer. Okay. So here it will transfer one SQL token from your associate token account to the token PD account. Okay. Now comes the token winner part. So in token winner part, we have to transfer SQL token from token PDA to winner wallet associated token account. So here, like first we are generating our seed, outer is the seed. And then you can see here, right? The from account is your token account and to account is your wallet to deposit to account. This is the associated token account with the winner wallet. And the authority is with the state PDA, okay? And then we are just signing our transaction and we are telling like to transfer amount of one. Okay. So this is about send token winner. Okay. Now I will do some demo. Let me do. Okay. Let me delete this terminal. Okay. So first I will start the local Solana blockchain. So it is running. Now what I will do, I will run anchor test. Okay. So it, here our test is running. Now we'll see this program ID in the Solana Explorer. Uh, now I'll go to Solana Explorer. Here I will search. Okay. So this is for deployment. It tells like your account has been deployed. Okay, it is for deployed, deploy part. It takes some time because there are many things uh, needs to be done. Uh, like after deployment, it will initialize your uh, state PDA, then token PDA. Then it, it will transfer the token from your account to token PDA. And then finally from token PDA to the other wallet account. So there are four, five instructions in this particular thing and also i have like committed this code into my github repository i will share the link in the description so if you want to if you want to just check like how many it is checking time because it is actually minting some token uh, some fake SPL uh, sorry Solana amount into your user wallet and winner wallet. Yeah, 
so now this part is basically for assigning initialize state video okay so here it is initializing your state video then this is for initializing token video yeah token video so three instruction has been done your program has been deployed your state has been initialized your token video has been initialized now it will transfer your SQL token to token video so if i open this one that that is that is for send token to video so this instruction has transfer token from your you can see right so this is like from your token account to the token pd account okay plus one minus one token okay earlier it was having five token so now it has like four token and uh, it has like one token in my code i am minting five token right so now it is four and one one has been transferred to token pd and the last will be yeah that is also done so this will actually transfer if you see here yeah plus one minus one okay so it has actually added this plus one account to your winner soc token account and it has decreased this account earlier it was having like one token account sorry one token one spell token okay now it is having like zero token because that token it has transferred to the winner soc token account so you can see send token winner and if i go to vs code yeah so it is success yeah so i i hope you like this video and uh, you understood like the entire flow basically how to transfer sql token from one account to pd and then from pd to somebody else account okay yeah thank you so much bye